Often when working in ZBrush you'll work symmetrically, which means you'll have your symmetry option turned on and as you work on one side of your model, the other side of your model is affected in the same way. In this case I have a head that isn't symmetrical. One side has clearly been sculpted while the other side remains the same. What we want to do is make sure both sides are symmetrical. To take this information on one side and push it over to the other side, we simply have to open up our tool palette, open up our deformations pull down, and then select this option called Smart Resim. But before we click that, there's a few steps we have to look at first. The first thing we want to do is mask off the side of our model that we want to mirror over to the other side. As we do this, we want to make sure our model is facing us straight on. So to do that, I'll rotate my model and then simply hold the shift key as I do it. You'll notice it'll snap into a straight on view. I'll then hold down the control key and click and drag to make a mask over the side of the model that I want to copy over to the other. Then you'll also notice in the Smart Resim option, you have the option of clicking X, Y, or Z. This is the axes that we want to mirror across. So in this case, it is X, so I'll leave X turned on, which is the default. Then I'll click Smart Resim. As I do that, ZBrush will take a moment to think about it, and then take all this information and mirror it over to the other side. Now that the information has been passed from one side of the model over to the other, I'll hold down Control, click and drag in the empty area to clear my mask. Now that my model is symmetrical, I can continue working on it with symmetry. So I'll tap the X key to turn on my X symmetry, and then continue working. 